Hi everyone and welcome to my video. And in today's video, we are going to hit the subject of hair loss once again because a majority of you guys have hair loss, otherwise you wouldn't be subscribed to this channel. So, you know, I always hit the subject about um, covering the top and then telling you about the hairline and, you know, just basically, it, it, it's basically telling you guys about the loss that I have and I show you how I cover my loss. But there are so many of you that email me and say, what can I do about the sides? You know, I have a bold spot on the side or I have very, very thin hair on this side. What can I do? So I'm here to show you how to use fill in pieces to fill in those bold spots that you have on your head. So right now I have a no track frontal in the front. So I'm going to take it out and I'm going to show you. Um, well, actually I can do this. I have the no track frontal here. But as you can see, like my hair, well, let's show this eye. Okay. Should I just take it out? Should I just take it out? Okay, let me just take it out. <laughs> so I can show you. My hair grew back so much from that castor oil treatment. Just letting you know. So if you want to know about the castor oil treatment, I'll put the information down below. Or at the end, I'll put um, the whole um, hair growth playlist up here so you can follow it and maybe it will help you. I hope it does because it has helped hundreds of people. I'm not joking. Okay, so here is my hair. I was concentrating on the top of my hair. But what about this? What about that? Okay. What about that? Now, my hair loss isn't, I mean, it's bad, of course, but it's not as bad as some other people. I mean, I, I get pictures all the time from you guys, and you're like, help me. So what I would do is, no track frontal. I'm just going to show you. This is a brand new one. This is the color 1B. This is it. Okay. So I'm going to open it up. It has clips in the back. The reason why I like this, and I say it all the time, is because it has no track. And there are a couple of tracks that are sewn into like a little piece of lace. So it makes it a little bit thicker than just getting a track from the beauty salon and you actually see the track. I don't like it. So we want a thicker piece. So what you do is you would take, I'm so not professional at this, so please don't kill me. Let's just say. You take a no track frontal. You want to hit, let's see if I can get it closer. You want to, let me see, do it like this. You don't want to put the combs on here, okay? I mean, you can, but you want to put a little bit further. So you want to put the combs over here. This way it goes in here. You want to go against there. So I'm going to do that now, okay? So let's just say you wanted nice look at that look how nice that looks right flip your hair over you can do the other side if you wanted let's just say you wanted to do the other side i have a longer piece here some of these pieces do not match but does it really matter <laughs> right now okay so i'm going i can see i gotta look in the mirror <laughs> again not professional just and you see do you see that? I use two track front, no track frontals on the sides. Now, let's just say I wanted to use one in the front. Now I'm using a smaller piece. This is an eight inch piece. Excuse me. And you can wear it like this. Look how much fuller that is. Look, and I put in my 80s clip as I always do. And voila, look at that. The sides are done. This is not the same color as my hair, so don't mind it. And this one has like a, like a finger wave to it. This one is used every single day. So it might look like a different type of, of texture, but yeah. So I use three pieces here. I use an eight inch. I use, actually this is a 16 inch over here and this is a 14 inch. So I mean, you don't have to get a 14, 16, and eight inch. You can get 
an eight inch on top you can get a 14 inch and you can basically put these anywhere like these are filled let me just do this quick i hope you guys understand because i'm just like rambling on because I, that's what i do i ramble okay so let's just say let's see if i could just fill in a piece with an eight inch how it would look okay let's fill in the eight inch eight inch piece i'm going out let's fill it in let's just let's just make believe right here use your imagination that there is a larger bald spot here so when you wear your hair down you can see through like really really bad you don't want that so again fill in the piece i mean you can put these little pieces and you can put them all over you can straighten these you can curl them um you can basically do whatever it is you need to do if you want more hair in the back i have that problem too my hair is very thin in the back so you can take your piece i did not come prepared guys i get an f for preparation <laughs> i'm just doing this quick you can basically do that look see you could do that and then you can flip your hair over however you want just so you don't see it i'm just playing I'm just showing you different ways that you can put this in. Um, I like these no track frontals because they do not hurt your hair at all. I mean, I feel no tension. There are times, because I don't, don't wash my hair every day, so I'll keep them in. I'll keep them in for two days at a time. It does not bother me. It does not ever give me a headache, ever. I have a lot of people that write to me and they're like, oh, just received. The hair, let me put the hair the way that I usually have it. Just received the hair and it's not working out for me at all. Um, can I return it? Now, when I first got these pieces, I didn't even know. Uh, this is what I was doing when I first got the piece. You ready? This is what I was doing. Although it looks pretty good like that. Um, I did not want anything that can show that it starts right here but you can totally, totally pull this off. Um, so I wanted something that really looked like it was coming from my scalp. I tried and I tried. I mean, I was on the verge of throwing the pieces out. So then I came up with this, but some people don't have the hair to put in the front. So you can totally wear it the way that I just showed you. But I say to you, don't give up on it. It's your hair. If you want your hair, to look um, fuller, then I say take the time and play with it. You will eventually get it. And I tell everybody this all the time because I was there. Don't give up. Even if you buy a human hair topper, by the way, these are human hair. If you wanted to buy a human hair topper, don't give up on it. People, oh, it looks fake. It, I promise you, play with it. There are so many things on the internet. Look at my hair topper 101. Um, playlist i'll put that up here at the end of this video so you can look at all the tips on how to make a topper look so much so more realistic and i'm telling you your problems will be solved if you really want to purchase these pieces which are beautiful i will put the link down to my facebook down below click it and from request me that's the only way that you're going to be able to to order these so go to my facebook right down below don't forget if you're not a subscriber please subscribe to my channel so you can be alerted and you press that notification bell you'll be alerted on up and coming videos that i make so you will not be out of the loop okay i hope i didn't ramble on if you have any questions please put them down below. If not, I'll put my email down below and don't forget, email me. If you don't have a Facebook, email me. My email will be down below. And that's it. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you'd like to cover, if you'd like me to cover any other um, topic on hair loss and I would love to do it for you. As always, I love you all and I hope you all have such a beautiful day. You better Bye. squat. Say it again. You better squat. Subscribe. Uh, you better, you better subscribe. You better stop squire. Subscribe.